Why am I burning up? <laughs> I feel like the Jonas Brothers were kind of like spot on with that. Redress! I mean, it was a line delivered with love. <laughs> Next, I'm gonna go try to secure some birthday cards, and then after that, I'm gonna make my return and skirt back home. Can we please get some L's in the chat? I wasn't able to return the flip-flops. I guess something's weird with the system where I need to speak to a higher-up manager or something to return them if I really want it to that badly, but at this point, I was like, whatever. Now that I have them, I'm just gonna find a way to make them comfortable and actually wear them. I'm just gonna get these two cards and head on back. I don't think I've ever made this turn before. friends of mine for just like a museum hangout then i have to take a zoom call and i really hope the museum has wi-fi because if it doesn't i'm gonna have to leave the museum and come back when the meeting's over to go to a local coffee shop i'm just hoping that the coffee shop would have wi-fi because if they don't i would be on my cellular data yeah my cellular data it's really bad but in the meantime i'm just getting ready i think i want to like go over part of my thing with like a flat iron because it's kind of frizzy right now i'm not a big fan of fl a flat iron normally i just like blow dry it should i do something to this while that's heating up i'll show my fit um it's gray, gray themed, like kind of feminine. I don't know, maybe you see my vision, maybe you don't, you probably don't. Is this zoom in? Yes, yes we are. That's a little bit amazing. I'm gonna put my hair up because when it's down, it just gives me too much grief. It's definitely going up. I haven't eaten today yet. I might like have a lip gloss, but I do not. I do have this. It doesn't really look like anything. It makes me feel like I'm doing something, so it's, it's just fun. Mascara. Why is that like... I'm using Covercle. And basically after I do this meeting, I have an in-person meeting, which I don't know. It's just like a lot to do, but that's okay. That's okay. I feel like the more things I have set to do, the better I feel. Like it feels like my day was spent doing productive things. Probably look exactly the same, but that's okay. If there's one thing about me, I'm gonna be bad at doing my hair. We do the best we can. We are now on the floor and I will in fact be using this screen as a mirror. And I'm just gonna put my hair up. We have my infamous butterfly clip. This is used every time I want to put up my hair. <laughs> cool. So, I'm just gonna avoid the little ringlet. And then, it looks a little messy, but the curls are gonna fall out. Here's the hair. It could, it could be better. Let's be so for real. It could be better, but that's okay. We're taking it one day at a time. We are experimenting. We're letting ourselves make mistakes. This is unrelated, but I took myself to the bookstore and I ended up coming back with the Goldfinch and then I got All About Love by Bell Hooks. But literally look at this. This is the densest book I've ever held, truly. And the print's really small. 
I like started reading this book one time in the bookstore and I really loved Donna Tartt so I was like I have to read The Goldfinch. Every time I started reading it I was like who is this young little boy that I'm reading about? But then I found out that I think the main character is like an art curator and he starts doing some shady stuff. And that intrigued me. It intrigued me and now I want to read it. This book is so long. And does it go all the way to the very end? This book goes all the way into the very last cover. That's really something. I don't know if I should bring this with me. It's 769 pages. This would probably be the biggest book I've ever read if I end up actually finishing this book but anyway Donna Tart, amazing writer I started reading the first couple pages and I was intrigued I just kept thinking about this book so I was like might as well read it mm -hmm. 